Hey everybody, this video is going to talk to you about selecting a home page. So the first thing to understand is that if you set up a splash page, the splash page is going to be the first thing you see. Um, if you don't have a splash page set up, then the system will automatically find the very first page that is at the top. So then in this case, it would be your About Me page that you see here. If you wanted your site to not have a splash page and you wanted it to land on one of the pages you created, for instance, like a gallery list page, like something like this, then what you would do is you actually have to find that page and set it as your home page. So to do that, we're going to go ahead and go into the back end here. And what we're going to do is we're going to click on, let's say, this gallery list page, and we're going to click edit. And when you are creating a page, this option is always here, but you could always come back and edit it and select set as home page. And once you click set as home page and you click save settings, there's going to be a little green dot that's going to appear now. Um, and there wasn't one before. So if you were to change this and you wanted your about page to become your home page, you can click edit and you can set as home page and click save changes. And now it'll move that dot to that to that page so you always know which one's your home page. Like I said before, if you do have a splash page though, it's going to default to that page and in your splash page you're going to have to be linking to the page that you choose for people to enter in on. If you have this splash page set up and you no longer want to use it, you're going to want to go to the splash page area and you're going to want to revert to default. And what that's going to do is going to clear all the content out to make sure that there's no contact that content there and then the system will just skip over that page. So if you've already set it up and you want to clear it out, you come to the splash area, click revert to v default, it'll clear that out and then you can go in and set your home page like we just did. So I hope that helps you understand how to set your home page and if you have any additional questions, don't hesitate to contact us through support. Thanks so much.